AMD has just announced their all new Radeon RX 9060 XT and today we're going to be carrying everything you should know about these all new GPUs in terms of specs, price and some of the performance you can expect with these new GPUs. So let's get straight to what you need to know about the all new AMD RX 9060 XTs. Now the specs for these GPUs actually does include the following, which does include 32 RDNA 4 compute units, 32 hardware ray tracing accelerators, 64 hardware AI accelerators, a boost clock of 3.13 GHz, and of course, we'll have two options with the video memory with the 8 gb option and the 16 gb option. Now, the power draw for these GPUs are actually not too bad. So if you do go for the likes of the cheapest option, which will be the 8 gb option, it will have a power draw of around about 150 watts, which is pretty good. Now, let's say if you do want to have more power with your GPU, and you do go for the likes of the 16 gb option, that will only require about 180 watts of power, which is insane. Now, going to some of the pricing of these GPUs, it's actually very interesting. Now, if you do want to go for the cheapest option, which is the 8GB option, that will be starting from a price of $300 at MSRP. Now, of course, this can also change in terms of your retailer that you do get these GPUs from. Now, let's say if you do want to go for the more powerful option, which I believe will be the most popular option for a lot of users, which will obviously be the 16GB option, this will be priced at $350 at MSRP, which, yes, AMD is currently being NVIDIA in terms of pricing with performance. Now, to give you a perspective of how much cheaper these GPUs are actually compared to the likes of the RTX 5060. The cheapest option for the RTX 5060 is priced at $380, which is obviously the RTX 5060 Ti with 8 gigabytes of memory. And basically you can go for the likes of the 16 gigabyte option of the RX 9060 and still a lot cheaper and does have more performance, which does take us to the performance side of these GPUs. Now for the RX 9060 compared to the likes of the Nvidia RTX 5060 Ti, AMD's GPUs are expected to be 6% more faster when it comes to gaming without any upscaling at all, which means yes, AMD does have better raw performance and this is also at 1440p, which means yes, AMD does have a good GPU in terms of price and obviously performance. However, that's everything you should know about these new GPUs and of course these GPUs will be available with both options on June 5th, so it's not long enough away. But let me know in the comments below, would you go for these GPUs or would you go for the RTX 5060 Ti? But I also hope you guys enjoyed, so guys, thanks for your, be safe as always and have a great day, bye.